Thank you for choosing KAU. Um, we, we go to the students web portal. Uh, this is basically when you're registering for semesters and checking your academic progress. Um, we could get a quick run through of the web portal. Uh, just get to your green card and read your reg number as provided i can type mine one one five three dash zero four two five six dash zero two four eight zero then uh, you're given your default password choose login you you got you are going to find a portal like this with a number of manners, home, personal info, my course, chain password, obviously from what's in the default. Then under academics, we have the curriculum, session registration, lecture, timetables. Wow, a number of them. Then you can go to academic profile. Obviously, it's empty. Then let's go to our personal info. In case you really see that this info is, is incorrect, uh, you can come and choose edit, but it doesn't affect the system. Then you can go to my course. You're able to see whatever details were captured during registration. Then at change my password from the default then when we go to academics uh, area we have program curriculum session registration lecture timetables coursework exam timetables and academic profile wow so you can click on program curriculum here you find what courses you are registered with for all your course. Then this is good enough. Then session registration. Uh, choose academic here. Choose uh, the semester. Um, this is good enough. Then. This means you're not yet registered for the semesters. Others will be they will be appearing. Then lecture timetables uh, all are pending. Coursework you also be able to see your coursework. Academic profile grade and then the exam timetables. You really don't need to look at the university notes board for your exams then finance is intended to <coughs> provide you with all your transaction history such as uh, such as your financial statement um, your the fee structure and your payment plan wow so most important you need to really see what you've scored from the previous semesters um, then this would help you to see what courses you passed what courses you failed and you can actually choose them for registration to, to the next registration well um, after you're done then you and choose logout and choose logout and choose logout and choose home and, um, and then then okay, so they are made one by one until we choose logout. If it doesn't, let's logout in case.
things. Then we can go back. Oh, you close. Now you can do this. Mm. 